short <laughs> my roommate decided to turn our whole living room into a you know a sports bar he has a huge flat screen tv right his led speaker surround sound led lights um the people he the sketchy people he brought up in our dorm bringing wine coolers pizza wings all that stuff and yada 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 so, I'm just going to this, I'm not going to go through the full story. So, it was tournament night, right? He put out this whole flyer on this app called Yik Yak where you can send out messages, put the information all there, people came, y'all, and all that. So, <laughs> this boy decided to not wait. First time they bet, the first time, first time they played for fun, second time they played for items, you know, t-shirt, Nike, Gucci, Nike shoes, all that. Third time, third time time they pay for money <laughs> and i'm just like where y'all get all the money from some people came through with 500 dollars i don't know if it's real money or not i don't know all i heard with the numbers someone bought 600 500 300 200 some people even bought i don't know i'm not gonna say that much but i know they were lying someone said they brought in one thousand dollars i'm like you lying but whatever Y'all lying. <laughs> he, my roommate brought in, I think he said brought $200. He brought in $200. So people would just bet on each other, you know, yada, yada, yada. The bracket went on and on. Suddenly, it was my, my roommate was in the final tournament, you know, the finals. He won somebody who, in the back, decided who, who drunk too much, thought to just jump up screaming, saying, you cheated, yelling people. Over, over point of my roommate, you cheated. I'm just like, um, okay, first of all, okay, I'm thinking to myself, none of them are really that smart to think of no Chico's. Second of all, you drunk. And third, calm down. <laughs> this dude, this dude, after I told him, after, okay, I told, okay, I told the dude to calm down, like, calm down, it's not that serious. And this dude, I guess, honestly, in my opinion, I think the reason why he made that big outburst because he knew that my roommate was winning and beating him, beating his opponent that he betted on. So, <laughs> he decided to make an outburst to, get, to save his money. That's what I think. And when he threw his wings at my roommate, someone threw pizza, someone threw this, someone threw that. It was a whole food fight in the living room. TV got knocked over, cracked. Um, some people made dents in the wall. <laughs> Some people over here, that thing got out of control, okay? Mind you, it was about 15 people up in there. She forget, man, it was a hot mess. Some people, okay, I went to my room before that thing escalated because y'all ain't coming, I ain't getting involved in that. <laughs> y'all can't best believe that. So, anyway, it got to the point where I, because people were coming on my side of the dorm, my side of the dorm, and I'm like, oh, y'all better stay y'all over there, stay over there, stay over there. You know, stay over there. <laughs> because y'all ain't coming on my side with all that mess. Mm -mm, no, no, not today. <laughs> oh, man, I was just like, <laughs> so, it to the point where I pretty much had to go tell the, tell the security guard and the RAs, well, not the RAs, I told the security guard and he phoned in to RAs from my building. They came in. I have never seen so much. I have never seen so I've never seen all of this. And I was just like <laughs> everybody stopped. Everybody man everybody said pause. They were fighting. I'm just like um everybody soon, everybody was like everybody ran out as soon as they heard, you know, the RA come in because she had like this little siren on her on her walk walkie talkie, you know that she's coming. 
they all ran out. Some ran to the hall room across the hall. Some of them run. They were like scattered like ants. Scattered like ants. I'm like <laughs> scattered. Scattered, man. <laughs> some ran to the multi-purpose room. Some ran like they bumped into each other. All that. I'm just like <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was laughing so hard at that. Anyway, roommate and my roommate got in trouble. He got a fine, which he never paid, but somehow he still managed to transfer. <laughs> that dude, anyway, he was mad at me. I don't know why. It's just look, call me a snitch, call me whatever you want, okay? But I'm not having, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not having, I'm not paying no fine because you decided, you, you decided to bring your own little mad casino up in here. <laughs> This one is the main reason why I hate the game because I had bad experience with that game. That one experience ruined my whole thing for the whole entire game. Like, ah, every time someone asks me you want to play Madden, I'm just like, mm, I'm good. No. <laughs> I'm sorry. Can't do it. Can't and won't do it. Anyway, at the end of the day, my roommate got, was mad at me for about a week. Didn't really care. Didn't really like the dude. I kind of had no choice but to, you know, you know support him because he was my roommate. But yeah, um, all everybody got in trouble. No fine, all that. So I don't know where they are now. We don't care. But <laughs> then it's something off my nose. Honestly, I'm kind of glad I did tell because if that thing got any worse, if they started rolling into my room, like on my side, I'll be jumping that thing and I'll I'll be jumping the whole entire thing and mess up everybody. <laughs> you ain't coming on my side, ruining my stuff, been ruining my chains, my Nikes, all that. You ain't doing that. Mm -hmm. Not today. Anyway, that's the story of pretty much why I hate Madden. Any Madden game. Is that, in that fact, in matter, in that fact, in that <laughs> matter of fact, because people have a bad experience. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and comment. You know, all that good stuff. And, you know, <clears throat> you know, have a good day. Dab out.